All right, our next product. This is our third pick of the week. This one was actually launched on the very first day that we launched the brand new Gromit. And they were our first ever product of the week winner. Um, so every week, if you didn't know, brands compete to be the product of the week where they get the most votes and the people are checking out their product. It's really the most loved product of the week. They were our very first ever winner of product of the week. And you might think it's a stupid idea to have a product of the week, it's but cool. their product is actually called the stupid car tray. So <laughs> congratulations to the stupid car tray guys. I love these guys. I had a chance to interview them, talk to them. Marcy's got one of them uh, in her hand. So I'm going to turn it over to you. Tell everybody about the stupid car tray. It is a stupid invention. Actually, this is like my dream come true invention. Kudos to you guys for creating it. I spend so much time in my car. It's kind of ridiculous. My car is my workstation. My car is my makeup station. My car is my food station. It's everything. And when I saw this, I couldn't order it fast enough. So basically what it is, is it is a tray that fits it, that's designed to sit in the front seat right next to you, although it's it's great for the back seat for kids too. But as you're seeing, there's only two legs here, one, two, and on this side, there are no legs because it's designed to even out, you know, our car seats do this. And when you position it correctly, it's going to do this. So it's designed to even out your car seat. I have the deluxe version that has that non-slip grip pad right here, which keeps anything that you put on it firmly in place when you're driving. And then I love the border here as well. That's also that non-slip kind of silicone grip. It's got built-in little compartments for anything and everything. And then all kind of accessories like this cup holder right here just fits right in there. And then another cup holder here, as you're seeing, fits here. This one, if you're wondering what these grooves are for, it's so smart because this is for coffee cups where the handles go or a mug, you know, those new Stanley mugs that everyone's loving that's got the, the water mug with the handle on it. It fits perfectly right in there. So it gives you extra cup holders in the car. Although you don't have to use those, you can use these for things like your cell phone, pens, whatever you need to have access to. And then it's got Velcro strap underneath, which I'm gonna show you so that you can secure anything to the top. See, these are sort of bungee straps. They just Velcro together. I got to use this firsthand for Thanksgiving because I was in charge of making a yam casserole. And by the way, I'm not a big yam fan. That was, <laughs> I, I took one for the team on that one, but it was um, kind of almost like mashed potatoes before it was cooked, but more liquidy. And I'm in the car by myself, taking it over to my dad's house. And I'm a nervous wreck thinking it's going to go everywhere. And then I went, oh my gosh, I have a stupid car tray with me. I'm going to try it. And so I did. And I put my casserole right up here. This evened out my seat for me. I wrapped these elastic straps around the top of the casserole and my mind was at ease the whole way. Otherwise I would have been holding on to it, just you know, scared to death it was gonna fall on the floor. This keeps pizza boxes. If you're transporting a cake, anything like that, you never have to worry about it falling again. And for me, like even before this show, I'm doing my makeup in my car before I'm running up here. So I can use this. I put all my makeup brushes in here. I laid my makeup out on the table here and it just became my makeup station in the car. Great for a laptop. If you're someone who is on the road a lot and you're stopping to work or eat or whatever, it's just brilliantly stupid. I love this thing, and I think it makes such a fun gift for anyone 16 and over who drives or who goes in a car, because it makes that whole experience so much more fun and easy and convenient. I can't even tell you. Really yeah, awesome. uh, I have mine in my car, and the number one thing that we do is pizza, right? So with the kids. So strapping, the, using that kind of bungee strap, getting the pizza in there so it's not flying everywhere as I turn around the corners, and the cheese then gets all to one side of the like such a stupidly cool invention and i i interviewed the guys about about the name because obviously that's what we want to know like why did you call this thing the stupid car tray and uh they were talking to their wives and they're like this is just such like a stupid invention like are you guys really going to make this like this is stupid and you know and they were like this is stupidly obvious at the same time like why does this not exist why is this not in cars as it is and so they were like well let's just call it the stupid car tray and 
I love that because as a branding person, as silly of it, like as a name it is, none of you who are watching this right now are ever going to forget the name of the stupid car tray. Mm -hmm. And uh, I can also see you guys are taking pictures of that QR code like crazy. I've seen more QR codes go off <laughs> during this segment than any other segment we've had today, which is a testament to you guys have this problem. And we always say grommet products, like I, I want them to make your life a little bit better. And I think the stupid car trade does a great job of making your life a little better because stuff isn't flying around in the car. And so great gift, um, great for folks, uh, you know, multiples. If you have a family where you have multiple vehicles, so get one for you, get one for your spouse, get, get one for your kids. Kids, such a cool idea and invention, um, a gift that at first glance, they're like, really, you got me this? But a week later, they're going to thank you and say that this is probably the best thing, the most practical thing that they got in the entire time. Um, these guys, I'm going to pull up the Gromit site real quick. Uh, let me get that QR code off so you can see it. Um, lots of really cool pictures here. You can see even here, like your Starbucks order, like keeping that still. If you're getting like, you know, three, four, five smoothies. Um, you can see how the pizza is strapped in over here, but just really great guys. And again, right now, come over to the grommet, hit this upvote button. You're going to get 20% off. It takes it from $39.95 to $31.96. What a cool gift, $30 gift. That's what we're looking for these holidays. Not everything needs to be hundreds of dollars and spending a ton of money, $30 for a really, really cool gift. Just click on this copy code that copies the coupon code. And then you're going to go right to their website as with everything on the grommet. When you click buy with discount, you're going to go to their site. You're going to enter the coupon code when you check out to get that really cool discount. So, uh, Marcy, I'm going to pull us back on the screen real quick. And um, such a cool one that uh, I just love this one. I know you do, too. I know you've gotten to play with it. Um, love these guys. Just a stupidly cool and obvious innovation. And I agree with you, Greg. I think the branding is absolutely brilliant. I mean, even this little, um, it's like a anchor that secures it to the seat and it fits in the crevice of the back of the seat. This is called the stupidly secure seat anchor and it comes with it, but it's just kind of that added thing. And, and every, so everything they name is, you know, has comes with the word stupid, which is so fun and so memorable. And there are other trays out there that do things like this. This is the original. This is the one that's so high quality, that's got that grip, that's got all the extra bells and whistles. And you don't forget it because it's called the stupid car tray. The other ones, who knows what they're called, but this one is the one. So definitely, <laughs> if you're going to get someone a car tray for Christmas, get the stupid car tray. Love it. Well, uh, I'd love to hear from you guys in the chat. The chat's getting quiet. Marcy and I don't like that, right? We are, we're high maintenance presenters. We we need the comments. We need the chat. So what do you guys think of the stupid car tray? Is it stupidly obvious and amazing? Is it stupid? Like, what do you guys think of this? Leave us a comment in the chat. We'd love to hear from you guys. Um, and while you guys are putting some stuff in the chat, we're actually going to give one of these away. One of our favorite parts of the show. If you have not entered the giveaway right there, that QR code, make sure that you hit that enter the contest to win one of these. And uh, Marcy, again, I'm going to turn it over to you for any final words and to give away a stupid car tray. Well, I just want to echo what you said about the chat. I love the chat. And the thing that I've loved the most on the past couple shows is when you guys chime in and talk, tell us all the ways that you can imagine using these items. Last week, there were so many good ideas that I hadn't thought of. It was It's so smart. And so I love that. So if you have ideas of how you would use the stupid car trade, let us know that in the chat because there's obviously there's so many ways to use it. 